We may have noticed a white blimp in the sky over northern San Luis Obispo County the past couple of days. We have received phone calls and emails asking what it's doing here. And KSBY News reporter Alexa Bertola has some answers for us. That giant blimp flying over the Jardine area is an airship run by company LTA Research. Now neighbors here on Beacon Road and beyond couldn't help but wonder what it's all about. Right over our house. Oh my gosh. It's the next generation of airship and North County skies are being used for test flights. It just was flying around a lot and then landing at the airport again and taking off and landing again and taking off and landing again. So it was very interesting to see it right over the house. The blimp didn't have any markings on it. I mean, as soon as I was told, hey, there's a blimp outside, I was expecting to go out and see the Goodyear blimp or some other such branded um, item. Lighter than air research is behind this airship that's captured the curiosity of residents that live near the Paso Robles airport. Very cool. The Aerospace Research and Development Company, founded by Google's co-founder, has locations all over the map, including Sunnyvale in Mountain View, California, Gardnerville, Nevada, and Akron, Ohio. They're working to increase the capabilities and lower the cost of 21st century airships. Occasionally we've seen them through the years, like the Goodyear blimp would stop between LA and San Francisco going for football games but this was definitely an eye catcher. The company's goal is to improve humanitarian aid delivery while offering a zero emissions alternative to airplanes. The company says its airships will have the ability to respond to disasters by delivering goods or rescuing people. More specifically, their vision is to zero in on remote areas that cannot be easily accessed by plane or boat due to limited or destroyed infrastructure. It was just cool to see it. And you say we see lots of big things. We see the military planes and this kind of stuff, but this was very different. This was unusual. The company is building its 400 foot Pathfinder One airship in Sunnyvale. Now it's also working to build a much bigger Pathfinder Three. In Paso Robles, Alexa Bertola, KSBY News. Now there's no word on what this airship in Paso Robles is called. The airship has reportedly been spotted in Salinas in recent days as well.